And then, uh, normally we feel, maybe, are you familiar with the word, maybe we feel vulnerable? When you say, I need you? Yes, no? In other words, we feel sometimes exposed when I say, I need you. And then, uh, that is why uh, it is important. When, you, when we feel, I am vulnerable, example, I am vulnerable, I am exposing myself, my friends, myself. Uh, sometimes we, we think it is a bad news. Better to say, I am strong, I don't need of anybody, I, am, I can handle everything. Sometimes we feel it's better to be like that. But I have a good news for you. We don't need to be strong every day, every time, before all, every situation. We don't need to be like that. This is Eastern encounter is for understand. If we say, I need you, it's a good news. Because it's the way we can feel I am a human being. I am a flesh and bones. In this planet, in the earth. It's a good news. Yes, it's no good when inside of us, within us, we feel, I need I need something. Actually, we have many needs. Many needs. Right now, I think, uh, we, I, I include myself, we need maybe to rest a little after waking up so early and traveling here to Tagaytay. What time did you, did you wake up today? 3 a.m.? What is that? <laughs> Please fall asleep and then don't say trying to be wake up. And yeah, example, we need to sleep or maybe we need to pause for a while. After weeks the last weeks we were studying, making many things, some of you are working. Maybe we need to pause for a while and think about us. Maybe we need a little. Or maybe we need to express our needs and also to find answers for our needs. Sometimes we think que, uh, sorry, que es Spanish. Uh, Spanish. Uh, sometimes we think before our needs we don't have answers. And better don't say anything. But good news, you can express your needs and you will find answer to your needs. The world sometimes invites us to be quiet, don't say, don't express. But now, in this Eastern encounter, you can express your needs. You can express what do you need. And you will receive answer. But you need to express. If you don't say, I cannot guess. No, if you don't say anything, I, I, if you say nothing, I will not guess what do you need. And then the invitation is to express. And then, what is Easter encounter? I would like to, to use three points to express what is Easter encounter. Easter encounter in the, is in the first moment, time to discover, to encounter, and to challenge. Are you ready for everything? We will discover, encounter, and challenge. I challenge you in this Easter encounter. And then in the first moment, time to discover. A special time to discover our needs, to discover uh, what really is happening in our lives, to discover answers, as I told you before. And also maybe it's time to discover our real life. Our real life. Because sometimes uh, in the middle of our needs, we feel pressure. We need to pause because sometimes we feel pressure. Pressure coming from our families. You need to present good grades in the school or in the university or sometimes. Pressure coming from the social standards. Pressure maybe academic standards. You know? I know university sometimes is pushing the people you need to uh, achieve a good exam, etc. 
example, last day in FEU, I saw how they they are present. They were presented exam for the technical is to finish the to get the professional uh, yeah, card. Yes, and then they feel pressured. Oh, I I need to pass this, and also because university need to is to be in the ranking no? high pressure standard academics, right? That is why we need to post for a drive and discover what is happening in our hearts. And if this is your encounter, try to talk hard to heart. Hard to heart. Maybe in our lives we need maybe siguro we need to write direction sa ating buhay. Or siguro we need to kapayapan or pagkakasun. Siguro. That is why this time is for you. Discover, discover yourself. And the second point, no? Time to encounter. Encounter as a very good day, as a young people, time to encounter with whom? As uh, before told you, uh, encounter with us. Encounter with us. Encounter with others and encounter with God. Encounter with others, maybe we know, or maybe we don't know. Uh, raise your hand, see what they don't know more than 10 people in this sister encounter. More than 10 people. Raise your hand, see what they don't know more than 10 people. One, two, four, really? Wow. We need more activities to know each one. <laughs> and then, maybe we need to be open. What they need in our conversation, in our group sharing, what they need, what they like, how they face the situation. It's pretty good when we can share each other, you know, how we are living in right now as a young people. And uh, as we are sharing, be open. Try to be open and to listen with rest in respect and also attentive to others. Also, as uh, I tell you, time to encounter with ourselves. How? Through the time of silence. We will try to be as we are. You need time to cry. Cry. Sometimes I mean. Because sometimes we, we feel pain in our hearts because of many situations. You need to let your things come out. I think let's do it. This time is for you. This time is for me as we are. And heart to heart, really understand my life and as we told you before, uh, encounter answers for our lives. Even in this Easter, maybe we need to hear words very helpful. Example, A, you are important. Even in the middle of our, your, our uh, mistakes, you are important. You are valued. Or someone telling us, I understand you. I understand why are you living now? What are you living now? I can understand you. Even I will support you. Very good, no? Times, we will have time to feel and to receive this kind of sentence. And how? With the time, silence, with sharing, with listening to talks. We will have many things who will help us to uh, achieve or to get our answers. But I would like to suggest you then the, the following. Don't go, don't focus in the, in the common answers before your situation. Example, sometimes we say, I have a dream. No when we are, uh, like that I can share my, my one, I will share with you. These songs that we are playing, I, I composed this song. But you know where? In the Ghibli. How? 
we were traveling to, to Manila to Pasi, and everybody in the city was sleeping. And then I called this city, this travel, the travel of the dreams. Then everybody was like, <laughs> even with their mouths open. My goodness. But I couldn't sleep because I was worried I, how I will do my talks. And then I was repeating inside of me, I need you, I need you, I need you, I need you. And suddenly, one melody, melody came to me. Jesus, I need you. Only that. I like this. Jesus, I need you. What else? I need more read, read. Only this cannot be. And then we tell my reader in the gym, you know, 45, 50 minutes. I try then later, before I go down, I write in my cell phone. Jesus, I need you. And I need to remember the melody. I'm trying to do my best, no? But you know, uh, sometimes we we have dreams. But sometimes we have um, how say this? We have a common answer. Ah, I cannot see this. This is a dream, but it is not for me. Example. Because, oh, back it. I say, I am not smart, but it's the truth. Because, because I, I am poor. It's not true. This is not the reason. If you have a dream, you can achieve that. That is why don't focus during this Easter encounter and the common answers that you have in your life. Try to hear another answer. That is why the time of silence is very good because it's the moment when God can talk with us. And also, time encounter with God. Okay. I say, who is who really knows us? Who is who really knows what we need, what we really thinking, what we really feel? God. And then that is why give him the opportunity to talk with us. This is very contrary for that. I don't know if you are familiar with this sentence. God is talking with me. Yes? No, uh, I will share one experience. In the first moment, my sister, Gloria, and me knew the community in the high school. Let me see, Gloria is inviting us to go to the recollection for Easter encounter. But because I am very rebellious, I say, no, I don't want to go. But my sister said, ah, yes, I want to go. And then she attended the recollection. When the recollection finished, mm, gathered in the house, uh, in our bed, my sister was sharing with me everything in the recollection. You know? Ah, Angela, no, I did, we did, we share, we eat, many things, we play, many things. And I was not, oh, yeah, wow, well, finish, finish. But one thing called my attention. You know, Angela, my sister told me, God was talking with me. I was thinking, maybe this community is. Because normally God was not talking to we, we know we think like this. God is not talking to God. What is that? Yes, God told me many things, but I was pondering. How is it? How is she very happy telling this? That situation made me curious. And that is why I am a missionary right now. I'm curious. Why? Because I want to hear the voice of God. Let in this is the encounter. Talk with you. Because he wants to do that. He knows. All of us. And that is why it's not enough to encounter others, play games, if we don't give ten, time, sorry, time to God. We are here right now, not because it's an accident. No, it is part of the plans of God. It's not an accident. It's not something casual. No. It is part of the gifts that God has for you. And then also he is the excited, more excited to, to have this recollection and to meet you. And he needs also what? Your time. 
your openness, your openness to receive his message, your hands open, your heart open to receive his love, his mercy, his presence. That is why we will have a time of silence. Take advantage of this. Don't lose this opportunity. This is a gift. Maybe this is the moment more important for us to, to hear the voice of God. Okay, go to the third point, challenge. Time of challenge. I challenge you to have your own experience. Why? Because we will hear many experiences here. You are hearing me now. We have experiences that in our talks, many things, we, but it is not enough. It is not enough. You need to have your own experience. At the end of this history encounter, I would like to hear each one of you say, I have my experience of it is day. I don't have idea, I have experience. I don't have just sentence I learned, I have experience. Agree? Are you ready for that? Yes. No, are you already sleeping. Are you ready for that? Yes. Oh, very good. All of us need to have this experience. Agree? Okay, you're sleeping. Maybe after that you will be better. Okay, challenge yourself. Because God has a message for you. God has a message for you. And then you can say, it's a delicious experience only when you eat something. When I arrived here, everybody was asking me, are you eating kare kare? What is that? I don't know. Are you eating, for uh, example, dumplings? For example, they like kare. Uh, are you eating, I don't know, crispy uh, butter? I said, crispy butter. What else I do? Are you like? In the first moment, I say, what is that? Crispy butter. I didn't feel it in my life. I didn't. Never, never. Only I can say, wow, delicious crispy butter after eating. No? We can say, oh, delicious curry curry after eating. I am not making you hungry, huh? <laughs> I can. It's delicious. Not, I like not this really. You can invite me, you can invite me to the top, if you want to invite And then, this is the issue only after, after it is. You will say, God, Masaran, experience of God is a Masaran experience when you really, Masaran, when you really, really experience God. That is why I challenge you. Uh, let me share another short experience. In the first moment when I tried to hear the voice of God, really I didn't understand anything. Even what I can hear, I didn't hear nothing. And what is that? And then, before the tabernacle, before the, especially the cross of Jesus, I told him, if you don't talk with me, I will go home. And then, it was not time, and then I was making a 15 days of it. Pero, and then, in the second day, I, did, I was very lost, I didn't understand. Jesus, I will challenge you. If you don't talk with me, anything, I will go. I am very far away from my mom, my mom but I will look for a solution and I go home. I will give you this day, you can talk with me. You believe in this? It is real, yeah, I have no... He will like, this is real, real. And then it was in the night, in the evening, then I remained doing the thing, receiving the talks, trying to pray, everything. And the following day, maybe this is uh, so my determination. She will go home, and if I don't tell anything, she will go home. I don't know if Manila is able to go home now, but maybe. <laughs> and then the following day, you know, important to be open. I hear I am with you. And you are precious for me. It is real. It's not my mind. It's God talking with us. And then we need to be to put to do our part. Everything is ready for us. Everything is ready. Our team here, missionaries and disciples, prepared everything for you. But it's your turn. You need to put your part. You need to do your best. And uh, before that, uh, what, with this word, I want to explain this. Be opari. 
No bird. Pare. Oh, pare. This is my word. Oh, pare. Oh, very good. You will hear. Oh, pare. You know the story. They were for there 17 days inside of the cave because of the water, full the entrance. And then, because the water were entered, 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 they need to walk and move on. on. And then they was very deep in the cave. When the families realized that they were in the cave, many people started to tell them. It was in 2018. I read the uh, document and also I saw the movie. I don't know if you see the you saw the movie. Very interesting. And then um, what happened there? It was a really beautiful story because being there, uh, because of they were in the cave, in the cave, uh, they started to fear to miss the family. Even they started to cry to express the, their feelings. The, and also they thought we will die here because no one knew where they, they were. And then uh, the entrenador, I don't remember the name of the entrenador, coach, started to help them to be peaceful, to learn how to breathe, to save the oxygen also, oxygen also because the cave is a few. And they need to, to learn to be to be patient, to even to encourage each other to survive. Because the, when we are there, the, 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 maybe the first thought is we will die. Because they didn't break food, nothing, even water, nothing. And then after days, the team uh, achieved them swimming. You know, people from US, people from uh, UK, people from came to help them. How important was these people, soccer team, uh, I think 18 people, uh, because many people were, were uh, helping them. Outside the cave was the family break for them. Outside the cave was people preparing food for them, people helping them. Other people was bringing clothes, even the farmers over the uh, um, places, cultivated to receive the water they need to drain water in order to maintain one level of the water to rescue them. And this story is the same for me right now for all of us. We are here, but we need to put our effort to do our best. Through this, so all party. Why? Be open. Be open and also be positive in this Easter encounter. Open to receive. If you have a close hand, close heart, or close mind, you will lose this opportunity. Be open to everybody. Be open to receive and open to new and new friends. Also be patient as them. Because 17 days is a lot of time. Be in there. Be patient. Wait until the end. Maybe in the last moment you will receive the message from God for you. And then be patient. In the first moment, we will receive many, many things. Maybe we will not understand. But God will give you for sure the answer for you. And also be active. Try to be involved in all the activities while we are offering to you. Pray your time. Let's do it. Uh, time to play games, let's do it. Time to eat, let's do it. I think that's the most exact part. No? Time to eat, let's do it. No? Please think in others no, when you are eating. Okay, we are many people here. Uh, time to be silent, let's do it. And also respect the time of others. And be responsible. Be responsible. Uh, I think all of us have uh, have many invitations to go another place. 
if not at least uh, to be at home and to watch movies or go to the mall or something like that, no? if you don't have another invitation. But all of us are spending money here. Try to be responsible to this, with this, with your time, with the money you are investing here. Try to be responsible and enjoy this, uh, this encounter. And that is why, oh, as conclusion, lastly, you will discover and experience during these three days together the presence of God, the love of God. You will discover your needs and your answers. And you will challenge yourself. Don't escape. Don't escape. Try to be here and enjoy everything. And maybe you can ask God, uh, what is your message for me? What do you need from me? What I can give you? And because we want to enjoy this recollection, uh, as a team, we invite to all of you surrender your cell phones. Because we need to be connected in this Easter encounter, but disconnected with our gadgets. Because sometimes our gadgets are the most important in our lives. What about if we surrender our cell phones? After lunch, we will surrender and then we will, we will um, I say you can you have time to send your families the number senders the contact the number contact that you can they can call in case they are needed of you. Are you able to surrender your cell phone and to be like in the desert to receive the message of God? Are you ready? Yes. Oh, thank you. And then Oscar White, I will give you some minutes with these uh, questions. Just to, to think, just to post for a while, what do you want to achieve in this Easter? Even this question, huh? Uh, go to your heart and ask yourself, what do I need in my life right now? Ask Jesus also, what do you want for me, Lord? And what do you want for me? What we can do in order to take advantage of this Easter encounter. Post for a while, and later our MC will uh, give our instruction.